My name is Michael Bradshaw. I'm 17 years old and I'm from Bucks County, Pennsylvania. So growing up, my dad had a 1931 um, Ford Street Rod that um, he built actually right before I was born, finished building it right before I was born. So I grew up around that car and that's really what got me into cars and going to car shows with him and that. And from there it just progressed into other realms of the automotive industry that I really, uh, I really liked and really wanted to be a part of. When I was around 10, I decided I really liked Camaros and it first started with 69 Camaros, but I didn't really want to build one of them because there was a lot of them that were done already and they were kind of already very similar. And they were also getting very expensive at the time. So I found the second gen Camaros and I fell in love with them almost immediately after I found out about them. And that led me to really want to build a second gen. Um, in 2013, when I was 12, I actually bought my first Camaro, and the reason why I did that was not only because I wanted a cool car and something to have that um, I could drive and it would be old and it would be cool, but I met Kyle Tucker of Detroit Speed and Engineering, and he took me for a ride in his 70 Camaro, and that was it. I was hooked. In June of 2013, I went to the GM Nationals at Carlisle in Pennsylvania with my dad, and when we got there, we saw that there was an autocross track. And at this point, I really didn't know what autocrossing was or pro touring cars were or anything like that. And by the end of the day, I knew much more. Um, I actually met Kyle Tucker that day, and he took me for riding his 70 Camaro. And that was it. I mean, I, I was hooked from the get-go, and it was truly, um, truly something that stuck with me. And a few months later, went down to Detroit Speed, North Carolina, and met with Kyle, and uh, came home from that trip two weeks later bought my car, which for lack of a better word was a basket case when I got it. And um, currently it's much less of a basket case. We just, um, we had to do all the sheet metal work ourselves and we put a full roll cage in it. It has a Detroit Speed Quadrolink in it. Um, it's going to have a Detroit Speed Hydroform subframe with an LS motor and a TR6060 transmission. And it'll basically be a very streetable yet raceable second gen Camaro that I can have a lot of fun with and be very competitive with at Good Guys Autocrosses and USCA events. So this weekend we're at the 21st annual um, Good Guys show here in Columbus which I've been coming to for the last couple years and they have the autocross here and a few weeks ago um, I got in touch with Kyle and uh, we basically came up with this plan um, that I would get to drive this 65 Mustang here at Columbus this weekend in my first ever autocross event. So far I've made two runs and I'm improving and I'm really learning the car and, and getting the clutch down and really figuring it out and uh, having a lot of fun. And it's, 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 it's really cool that Kyle's trusted me with his car and five years ago I was riding with him and, and now I've moved up to the point where I'm driving and, and driving one of his cars and uh, getting some instruction from him and uh, really getting a lot of support from all the guys at Detroit Speed. I'm choosing Detroit Speed for my Camaro build because everything is American made and um, and they are absolute amazing products. Um, the biggest thing that I've, I've found with Detroit Speed is that you pay for what you get. It's everything is, is beautiful and actually my Quadrolink rear end, I don't want to paint it, it's so nice. And um, all their products are like that and they're built by awesome guys who know what they're doing and they have great engineers that engineer and test and tune their, their products and, and perfect them over time at events like this and, and make changes to really make the products awesome. And, and that's honestly why I choose Detroit Speed because I want something that's going to last, something that's going to be reliable and something that I can have a lot of fun with and get a lot of life out of.